Hi, I'm Steven Slate, and I'd like to introduce you to the Virtual Mix Rack. The Virtual Mix Rack is our new modular platform that will allow you to work faster, more intuitively, and more creatively. With VMR, you can create the channel strip of your dreams, or even several channel strips for different tracks. Let me show you some modules from our Mix Bundle. This is the FGN EQ, and it is a dead-on model of the classic British Class A EQ. This Fabrice Gabriel designed algo emulates all the beautiful saturation and transformer harmonics in a way that you have to hear to believe. We made several cool mods. For instance, the bands are completely continuous, so you can tweak any frequency rather than just be limited to specific chosen frequencies. We also doubled up the midband to make it a four band EQ, which will allow so much more versatility. The line input can be increased to add the same beautiful sounding saturation as the original. Let's hear it in action on some drums. The next module is the FGS, which emulates the Workhorse Mixing Console EQ. And again, all the subtle nonlinearities and musical band interactions that you don't find in many other emulations of this EQ are all modeled precisely. Let's use this one in conjunction with the FGN to craft out a great stereo guitar sound. The next module in the VMR Mix Bundle is the FG401. This is a VCA compressor that is based on several models including the classic mixing console compressor and also a famous VCA compressor known for its clever options and emulation of other compressors. The 401 has two circuit paths that sound unique. The first is going to be a bit more aggressive and the second circuit has a bit more elegance and smoothness. Then there's a button that engages a custom transformer, which will add fatness, warmth, and a bit more mid-range harmonics. Let's mess with the 401 a bit. We'll take this bass guitar, and I'm going to crank some lows with the FGN. Then I'll compress it with the 401 on circuit path 2 with transformer on. Then I'll follow up with the FGS to attenuate the low mids a bit. Here's the 401 on a snare track. We'll start dry and then go to the FGN to brighten and fatten the lows. Then with the 401, we're going to compress on circuit one with slow attack and medium release. Then check this out. We're going to use the mix knob on the 401 to mix the wet and dry signal. The last module is an emulation of one of the most popular compressor limiters of all time. It's called the FG116 FET compressor, and it probably looks familiar to many of the analog enthusiasts. But what's more is it will sound familiar too. That's because we modeled this compressor for almost a year to get it perfectly spot on. From the subtle transformer harmonics to the extremely unique timing and release. Let's hear it slam a lead vocal to the front of a mix. So I
Now let's smash some drum mics, but we're gonna use the added mix knob to back it off a bit. So you've heard the VMR's mix bundle processors, and by the way, to hear them compared against their hardware counterparts, you can visit our site. But now let's talk about workflow. When you have all of your processing chain on your screen at once, it is so much more efficient, fast, and creative. Let me show you. So I have my entire snare chain in the VMR. So rather than shift clicking multiple plugins and crowding my screen, I hit one button and there's my processing chain. So I love the sound of this snare, but I want some more brightness, so I'll just drag another instance of the FGN on the third slot and add some top. Now I'll save this into A. Okay, let's bypass this FGN, and now let's load the FGS, and I'll add some top with this filter. So now I can do a quick comparison and see which filter works better. So I like the A better, so we'll go with that. But I need some more sustain, so I'm just going to add the FG116 and dial in a bit of compression. And there you go. Let's pull up a vocal. Now we have all four modules here. So watch how I can mix and match filters. I love the mids of the FGN on a vocal. But now let's add a bit of smooth top from the FGS. And then let's start to compress with the 401. Now let's drag the 401 before the EQ to hear that. Okay, I like that better. Now let's add some 116 at the very end to give it a bit more aggressiveness. We'll do that with a medium attack and a fast release. The VMR Mix Bundle has four of the most precisely analog model processors you've ever heard. And the VMR interface makes mixing with them fast and easy. And despite the fact that it has some of the most sophisticated Fabrice Gabriel style analog modeling, it utilizes new techniques in native processing optimization. So unlike expensive DSP accelerated systems, you can run hundreds of instances. You can also track through the VMR with it in your actual DAW inserts, since none of the modules add any latency. And of course, we'll be making many more VMR modules in the future. Last, the VMR is stacked with tons of professional presets for individual modules and multiple modules. This is only the beginning. We look forward to making many more new cool modules for the virtual mix rack. Till then, happy mixing.